ice has bulldozed and carved the world we know on a colossal scale. But what is it that gives something as brittle as ice supremacy over the hardest and most resilient rocks to be found on the planet? To find out, you need to see inside a glacier. The Svartisen Glacier in Norway is one of the few places on Earth where ice can really be seen in action. It's thanks to this glacier that scientists are starting to understand the secrets of ice's great power. Deep beneath the glacier, in a chamber at the end, scientists come face to face with ice. Then it's two days of hard work using hot water to melt a cave big enough to get inside the glacier and see it in all its glory. Here's the ice tunnel, watch your head. Miriam Jackson's a glaciologist. She spends up to three weeks at a time down here. Look at that. It's beautiful. It's amazing, isn't it? It's absolutely beautiful. This is like a piece of art. This is, it is, isn't it? Wow. You've got to remember there's 200 metres of ice over us now. 200 metres? Yes. We're at the so, bottom of the glacier and the ice is over us. It's also closing in on us. As we speak, it's, it's contracting in, aren't it? Yeah. If we couldn't stand here for 48 hours, the ice would close in on us. We'd be stuck <laughs> fossilised in the ice, like a big ice cube. It's down here, right at the very bottom of the glacier, you can see how it carves out great landscapes and can slice through solid rock. It's not the ice itself that does all the damage. It's the debris that it picks up along the way that makes glaciers act like giant sandpaper. In effect, the ice uses the rock against itself. But the ice cave has another surprise. Have you seen this? It's an air bubble, is it? It's not an air bubble, this is water. Oh, right here. look at that! So this is, we opened this up when we were, when we were melting. <laughs> but before then it was totally enclosed in the ice. These water pockets apparently make the ice less brittle, so it can bend around obstacles in the landscape. A glacier is not the solid mass that it first appears. Seeing it from the inside has given me a completely different perspective. It seems almost alive. As if to prove the point, the ice invades a space we've left behind. In just three days, our magical ice cave disappears. <laughs> 